I'm coming to you guys today with a case collection and haul video, all the cases that I have bought recently for my iPhone X. This is going to be a collab video with Miss Queen Nificent, so go definitely check her out. She has a lot of fun videos on her channel. She does plus size hauls, hair videos, videos with her kids, a lot of fun stuff. She has a lot of techie videos on her channel as well, like a lot of stuff about phones and things like that. So definitely go and check her channel out. This is a collab. I haven't done a collab in forever, probably years, literally. We'll have her channel info listed down below for you guys to go and check her out. Don't forget to go and comment and let her know that I sent you by if you are coming from my channel. And welcome to anyone who is here who came from her channel. So let's get into the video. So as far as the phone that I have, I do have the iPhone X. I do have an unboxing video on this phone if you are interested in it and wanna know a little bit more about it or whatever. So this is the case that I currently have on my phone right now. As you can see, it is a iridescent type of case. I'm not gonna be trying the cases on my phone. I'm gonna actually be just showing them to you. Um, and yeah, so I don't know, I didn't plan on really just sitting here and holding the cases up but I may do that since that's how I'm kind of set up right now we'll see what works best but yeah this is the case that I have on right now and this is made by casemates and I did purchase this case from the t-mobile store this is the actual box for it I still have the box so yeah this one is good because it has the dual layers so it is a great protective case but it is also cute i have a few scratches on it so it does get scratched but it is really pretty and simple go ahead and show you guys this one because this one i've been getting a lot of questions on and i do have the little lanyard that comes with it as well which you can attach and wear it around your neck or whatever if you would like to this is a replica louis vuitton case or a dupe for the louis vuitton case a lot cheaper than the original one this one i believe i paid 25 dollars for and i purchased it from iOffer. i will put the seller that i purchased from somewhere down below or in the comments so you guys can check them out but you can definitely go and just search on iOffer for um designer brand cases louis vuitton phone case whatever so this is the signature prints in the brown monogram and it does have little gold dots all the way around kind of like little studs but they are plastic in this case is um, you know it's somewhat bendable but this part does feel pretty similar to what the bags feel like um, and then this is the other side of the case and the gold little dots are kind of rubbing off a little bit because I wore this case quite a bit but it's not anything crazy I'll probably go over it a little bit with some nail polish to help maintain it I did also order that same case in the red so if it comes in in time before I edit this video and like put it up, then I will insert footage of that as well. This phone case came in after I filmed the video, but I wanted to add it in since it did come before I have edited it. So this is the same thing, the Louis Vuitton, but the Supreme case in the red. And it does have um, gold on it like the other one. And it did come in this bag and it also does come with the same lanyard that you can use to carry it around your neck or whatever i did want to film right here because you know it's the holiday season and i never film with my holiday stuff so i do have a t-mobile bag with some items that i purchased from t-mobile so that case make case was one of them did also get a screen protector from t-mobile as well and this is an edge to edge seamless glass screen protector this one has impact and scratch protection edge to edge protection and it's by Sonix, S-O-N-I-X. So this is how the box looks. If anyone is looking for it, I'm sure you can probably find it online, but it was pretty expensive at the store. How much was this? $44.99. So, and that is the screen protector that I have on my phone right now. It really, you can't really see it much. It kind of just looks, you know, just like the phone, but it does protect your phone. And then I also did pick up another case. This one is by Kate Spade. And I already wore that one. Um, this is the first case that I ever put on my phone because I had already ordered cases, but I knew that they wouldn't be in in time. So this is how this case looks. It is a waterfall case and it does have champagne bottles and gold glitter. If you dogs can see that. I'm trying to get the champagne bottles to fall. So that is how it looks. Super, super pretty. Love this case as well. And it's a really thick 
plastic. It's not like one of those bendable ones. Like I can't even bend it here. It's really sturdy. So, you know, Kate Spade cases and stuff are pretty expensive. This one was $50 actually. And I don't even recommend paying that much for cases, but I only purchased them just because I was at the store and I knew that I needed a few starter cases because I didn't want to just be walking around with my phone with no case. So I also picked up another one by Casemate and I haven't used this one at all. Um, and I got this one from T-Mobile as well. These are like most of my more expensive cases that I picked up from the store. They do come with a bumper like this, so it does help to protect your phone. Um, and then this is the actual case. This one is also a waterfall case, but this one is a glow in the dark one. And it just has pink and yellow and stuff in there. And I just thought it was cool that it glows in the dark. I haven't actually tried it out at all. Um, and this one I probably really didn't need, but whatever. I thought it was cute. So I picked that up. Your dogs know I love pink, so I couldn't pass it up. Also in here, I still have the box for my phone. I also did purchase a wireless charger. I don't have it in here with me. I wanted to grab it for the video, but then I thought maybe I shouldn't even show it because I feel like it's pretty slow and it doesn't charge my phone that fast. So I find myself not really using it. All of the rest of the cases that I have are from AliExpress. Um, I don't think I purchased any from eBay, but eBay is also a good site to go to. This is one of the cases that I have. It is gold. And then I do have a puff ball on it in pink, which I thought was cute with like a little chain detail. You guys know I love pink, so super cute. This is how the inside looks. It is somewhat sturdy, but it's very flexible as well. So I just thought this was cute to add a nice little touch. The puff ball looks, you know, just looks really small. So I don't know, maybe I might have to try to do something with that. Here is another one, looks like this. And a lot of these cases I have not used on my phone at all. So this is how this one looks. It looks like an ice cream cone with some sprinkles on it. And yeah, I just thought this was cute. I like food cases and cute little stuff like this. And then it was pink, so it kind of reminded me of like strawberry ice cream. And that's usually what I always get when I go to like Marble Slab or something. I'm not going in any particular order. I'm just grabbing cases out and showing you them because I do have some that are like the same thing in different colors. So like this one, I know I have this one in a few other colors. It does come with a string or like a lanyard. And this one is like a Mickey Mouse case that looks like this. And this one is just glittered with like little glittery ears. So it looks like that. And I just noticed that this piece actually does come out. It's just like a glitter sheet. So, you know, you can kind of just buy clear cases and cut out glitter sheets or whatever and make your own phone cases if you want to. I don't think this one is the best quality, but this is a cute throw-on case when you want something that's really thin and flimsy. Not really great for protection, but you know, they look cute. I picked up this case. Probably kind of hard to see. I'm going to take the plastic off, but it is holographic and I love holographic stuff. So whenever I seen this phone case, I was like, okay, let me just get it because it looks really fun. Probably going to get scratched up really easy, but I thought it was cute. Let me see if the, if it has like a sticker. No, and it's not a sticker on the inside. So that's cool. And it is like a jelly case, but it is bendable. I'm just going to keep the plastic on it until I decide to actually wear it. Also picked up this case. All of these cases are relatively inexpensive. Probably all under like $10. The ones that are from um, AliExpress. I picked up this one as well. It does come with a lanyard also. And it is braided a little bit better than some of the others. And then this one looks like this. And it has silver lips all over it. And it's just very metallic and pretty. And they are... 3d and this case is you know flexible it does have like a little paper in it but it is flexible and this one did come in other colors i believe it came in like a metallic red and a metallic pink but i wanted to get silver just because i don't think i really had a lot of silver cases can you guys tell me what this is for it comes with a lot of my cases came with this little thing in the bag they kind of look like little guitar picks but i'm guessing Maybe they are to take your case off or smooth out your screen protector. I really don't know. But this is the next case that I got. And it is a waterfall case as well, if you guys can see that. And it does have some pink or purple type stars in it with glitter. 
And this one is a Audrey Hepburn picture. If you guys don't know, I do have an Audrey Hepburn picture up in my beauty room. So I just thought this was cute and it was kind of like the bubblegum thing. I think I got the Maryland one as well where Maryland has the pink bubblegum. So I just picked this up because I've always loved Audrey. Putting this bag up here so we can get through with this. So this next one that I got looks like this. And I did get a lot of little thin ones that are not very protective, but they're cute to just throw on whenever you want to just switch up your phone case. This one looks like this and it has a girl that is shopping and her face is covered by boxes. So freaking cute. And then there's like a little hat box on the side. This is totally me. And yeah, I just thought that was cute. They had a few more that were like Barbie inspired cases. I picked up this one as well. Classic black and white Barbie with the pink lips. So pretty. And this one is thin as well, but you can't bend it. But this one is like one of those plastic ones, so. Just be aware of that whenever you are shopping. If you don't really care, then it doesn't really matter. All these plate cases were pretty cheap. Got a few cases that are like fashion inspired. So that one came with that little thing again, but this one looks like this and it does have the waterfall. You will notice I have a lot of waterfall cases, but this one has like a purse or a shopping bag, a watch, a shoe, um, some lipstick, sunglasses, heels stuff like that so really girly fun stuff that you dolls know i love so pretty picked up another one that is very similar but this one has actual makeup on it and this is right up my alley so i picked that up they probably should have put like a different color glitter because most of the makeup on it is pink but i think you can still see it really good so that's how it looks I love the waterfall cases, but my cousin was telling me something that somebody's broke and their phone blew up or something crazy. I don't know, but I've never had that issue. So then this is the next one. A lot of them came in like resealable bags. So if you want to keep your cases in a bag, then you can do that. But I'm going to throw all of this packaging away. So this is the next one. And it does have 3D hearts on it with little glitter in them. I actually wanted to get my nails um kind of something like this tomorrow but i couldn't find the little confettis and they are raised if you guys can see that they are 3d with pink glitter and confetti i actually thought that this was going to be like a waterfall case like where the glitter inside of the hearts will be able to move but it's not it's just like jelly and stuff in there it doesn't move at all i think i got that case in another color but i don't know where it is so then here is another case a lot of these came with this little thing. Like, I don't know what's up with that. Like, somebody please tell me in the comments what is this used for. And then this one looks like this. It does have the waterfall once again. And on this case, it says, Bitch Repellent, a spray a day keeps the bitches away. So I thought this was cute. This one that I have looks like this. Came with that little thing again. And this one looks like a water bottle and it says magic bottle. So I thought this was cute because I'm always drinking water and it does have like silver glitter with purple or pink stars going through it. So I picked that up. My next case, this one is just like the other one, but it has blue little confetti hearts inside of the hearts. You guys know I love pink and blue, so I just picked them both up. And these are kind of sturdy, but they're still bendable, but not as thin as some of the other ones. Comes with a pink string, and it looks like this. You can probably see it better with a little insert in it, but it kind of has a gradient effect. This does come out once again. Oh, and it's gradient on the phone. So if you don't want to have the glitter in there, you can just take this out and wear it that way. So that kind of gives you two different looks with it, which is kind of cool. So yeah, a 3D blinged out case. I kind of wish I would have got it in the all clear because this one, the pops of color in it, I don't know. I just think they could have did better with this case, but I got this from AliExpress as well. And I, oh, I like the, um, the case that they used to put this on. Because my last one that I had, I think it was plasticky and it was breaking very easy. But this one is more of a nice sturdy case. But this one has jewels all over it. And I picked this one because it's like my favorite colors. Pink and teal and then with the 
classic clear or regular diamond so it's really really blingy and pretty so i don't know i had a case like this for my um recent iphone and i just had the clear stone so i was like let me try a different one because i used to wear that case all the time sorry if y'all hear versace he is like right over there eating his food so it's like a perfume inspired case and it looks like this it says fashion on it so i will guess that's what we're gonna call the perfume and then it does have the waterfall so really cute and this one is quite sturdy as well it's not as flimsy as some of the others so you definitely can get good quality cases on aliexpress and stuff but you just kind of have to know what you're looking for next case some of the bags do say iphone 8 but it's definitely cut for a um, iPhone X or 10. So this is the next case that I have and it's like a marble case with holographic going through it in a teal color. This is how it looks. I will peel some of the plastic back so you can really see it. So pretty. And I wanted a marble case because marble is so cute and stuff but I don't really care for like the classic plain marble. So whenever I saw that they had the blue one and I think I got a pink one in here somewhere as well. Plus it had the holographic going through it. I was like, yes, that is me. Next one, I have the fuckboy repellent. A spray day keeps the fuckboys away. Same thing. So yeah, these are just fun. They they have a bit of profanity, but it doesn't actually spell it out. It has a heart instead of the U. So, I mean, you can figure out what it is, but it's not as bad as having the full curse word written out. So then I also have the Marilyn one with the waterfall. And it looks like that. And Marilyn has the pink bubble gum, which is super cute. I've always loved Marilyn and Marjorie. So I was like, okay, let me get them both. So pretty. I just love waterfall cases. I don't know if y'all dolls noticed, but like almost maybe 90, 80% of my cases in this video are definitely waterfall cases. So then here is the next case. This is another marble one and this one looks like this wait i'm trying to get the paper out so this one looks like this and it is pink with the marble i don't know why but i was thinking this was more of like a bubblegum pink but it's definitely more of like a baby pink but it's still very pretty and i like the holographic on it that makes it look really really cute so i got that one as well the next one that i got is another mickey mouse or mini mouse type of case this one came with like a yellowish brown string and this one looks like this it is yellow you guys know i love yellow so i was like let me give me a yellow phone case and yeah this one is made just like the other ones um and the glitter sheet does come out and it is ombre on the actual plastic part of the case lastly for the mickey mouse or Minnie mouse cases i got this one which is clear i had this same one for my other iphone with the actual diamonds or rhinestones in the ears and it is on both sides um but this one doesn't have like a glitter sheet in it at all it is just clear so your phone will show through but i can use the glitter sheets from my other ones with any color that i want to because it'll match but yeah i got this one as well because this is one of my favorite cases that was really lightweight and everything but it still you know drew some attention next cases that i have are some bigger 3d type of cases kind of like my mosquito cases and stuff that i had last time i didn't pick up any mosquito cases um this time but this first one that i have is like a perfume bottle and it looks like this so i thought this one was really cute on here it says ready for you who wants to become cooly I believe that's what it says c-o-o-e-l-y or maybe that's supposed to be something else i don't really know but the message that was on it really didn't matter to me because i figured the glitter would be covering it most of the time but this one is a waterfall case as well but it is 3d and i don't know if you guys can see that but you can push it like it's soft and squishy but yeah, I thought it was cute. I really wish the perfume name said Batty or something. Like, I don't know, just something cute. But this one does come with this piece. Um, and you can attach this to the side part right here. So you can hold your phone by it or whatever. 
So I thought that was cool that they included that as well. These cases like this were a little bit more expensive um, than like the normal like two dollars or whatever. Um, and I am waiting on another one to come in so I will insert that as well if it comes before I get this video up. So I also picked up this one and it is an ice cream cone and it looks like this. I thought this one was really cute and it's 3D so it looks like that. And this one is mushy as well. These are kind of, you know, a little childish but they cute. I like them. Here's the last one. This one does come with a lanyard as well. And it looks like this, a little pineapple. And then the phone case is an actual pineapple and it is mushy. This one has like a lot of water or liquid in it and it has gold stars going through it. So really pretty. I just thought this was so cute and I love like fruits and like different phone cases that are like food and stuff like that or little snacks. I just thought it was cute and I just love anything pink. So. That is everything that I had in my phone case bag that I was using, you know, for the time being. Okay, guys, so that's it for this video. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Don't forget to go and check out Miss Queen Nificent's video and make sure you tell her that I sent you by. I will be doing another video for a what's on my phone video, so that will be coming really soon as well. But I did want to get this out of the way. And yeah, Merry Christmas, Happy New Year's to everyone. And let's get 2018 on and shit popping. Bye, dolls.